On a day when nine seniors were recognized here in Osborne Stadium, the Liberty Flames fall just short. 1-0 in favor of the Florida Gulf Coast Eagles in this A-Sun East battle. Corey Spector here with Adam Godwin and Adam. Liberty certainly had some build-up play in the midfield in this contest, but once the ball got to the final third, there just wasn't enough there. Yeah, it was defenses on top for sure. And yeah, the Flames, you know, little opportunities where you think, you know, for example here, like, oh, we're in. Okay, what can we create here? And fair play to Gulf Coast, always managed to answer the bell all night long. Meredith King here getting away, finally beats someone. Brilliant, can I get away? Now nah, can we get a shot? Can we get a shot? Phenomenal recovery there, you know? And that seems to be the story of it. Um, kind of all night long, where, or all afternoon long, where it wouldn't quite fall the right way for the Flames. Um, and it was always just going to take one moment, maybe capitalizing on an error or something. That ended up being what it was, a, a misclearance there, losing out on the header there, a late step here, and in the end, a super strike. And that was the difference. Malaya Melanson with the only goal in this contest as the Eagles escape with a 1-0 victory over Liberty. And most of the stats will point in the direction of Liberty. Yes, the 10 shots for Florida Gulf Coast. The corners tell the story of how much the Flames had the ball in this game. Yeah, but I think it probably tells the story of how Gulf Coast answered the bell. Like, you shall not pass. You might get throws, you might get corners. We're not letting you in the box. I think we talked about, um, you know, Maddie Oliver really had the ball once in the penalty area. Casey Jamison only had one free, one shot. That was from a free kick. I think Florida Gulf Coast did a phenomenal, it was a, this is a phenomenal away performance. Nothing fancy, just very gritty. And then can we take a chance at the end? Eagles now nine and seven on the season. Liberty drops to 10, six and one. Both teams with six points in the East Division. So Florida Gulf Coast gets the better of Liberty. One nil today from Lynchburg, Virginia.